Yes, it's good day. It's your 876 Agri Boss here, and we're here today under this cocoa tree. We're not gonna do a cocoa video today, but uh, just to provoke some some of my viewers to make some comment. Have some lovely cocoa back there. Look at that. Yes, so we're gonna do a video today on our coconut germination. So not gonna waste any more time let us get into this right away guys yes yes so i was just going through this field checking out some of the work done here yes and i can say leave a thumbs up comment share like as well right job well done so we're gonna make our way over to our coconut nursery and i'm gonna share some yes, i'm gonna share some information with you with you. Yes, I'm over by the coconut nurse, you know, and I'm going to show you how we germinate, germinate our coconut here on the research station on the farm today right so this is our varieties right here this is this is all the coconut we're gonna set you can take a look at this right now this is uh, what we'll be setting in the beds today and this is the basic thing we do so what we do, we align these coconut right here into these specific lines. We use our bamboos to keep them in line, right, to make one bed. So this entire here is one bed here we have, right, and we throw a little topsoil on that as well. These beds can easily hold up to a thousand coconuts, right. So this is the first phase, right? We make the bed is the first step. Five simple steps how to make your coconut germinate, right? So you make your bed. You align the coconuts on there, right? You put a little topsoil on there. So your next phase after aligning all your coconuts will definitely be covering up your coconut so what you will do you we either we use here on the farm we use the coconut fibers right or the coconut peat what as what some people may call it so we use the coconut fiber to cover them to create a false soil right that is easy easily removed after the coconut is is being germinated is germinated right so this is the other bed that will show you that, that phase right here so these are the coconut that are freshly aligned here. So this is like a few weeks after and you start to see these ones starting to germinate now so it's starting to react to the sun pointing upwards right so that's why you align them this way pointing out so the side that will germinate they, they, they will point upwards facing the sun um, you will get a very uniform layout like this then the second row will be behind here so let's check to see if there is any germination anywhere here Thank <laughs> you. 
so this is just a this is just a few weeks old right starting to germinate right now and it's firmly rooted now to the ground right so we're just gonna cover about this one so it can continue to do its plant like thing and grow right so we're just going through this area right now and we're gonna make our way over to, to the other beds that was set prior to so this is how we use the coconut fiber to cover these nuts we have here and this process will ensure that the temperature is insulated and kept constant as well as the moisture level so the, this prevents the nuts from being dried out the coconut husk or the whole coconut fiber right so we're gonna cover these finish covering these retains the moisture keeps the temperature constant so that we will get a fast rate of germination an improved rate of germination also but this is ideal material that creates a, a constant supply of temperature water that is critical for the germination period so this is what it looks like right through so we're getting some small ones here it is totally covered with, with our coconut peas here so this is what it basically looks like we got the root going from this section here right and from this end right here we have the shoot going up We have in here they will get to this size we have some lovely looking one here very uniformed very uniform growth we have here right and as you can see some of these coconuts didn't really do so well right so you try to take the one that is shaking that's a good indication um, to say yo this coconut has good potential to germinate so as you can see there's a line going back here this one right here this is another one right here and in this line again so it's perfectly aligned from the planting stage so this is one here this is another one here so one back here and there's another one there and there's five going out in each row so you can easily count them and check them off right. so in case you're asking the question if these nuts are special yes they are that's the answer to that question yes these are special nuts male part of the plant right and we send it to the lab to be processed right and when this get to us what we do for example 
we take a variety from the farm which is the maple variety which is um heavy producer produce large nuts and a lot of water good refreshing water a lot of mineral content this plant is highly resistant to disease and drought condition also salt condition as well so what we do we cross this with our dual variety that um, this tree may become an hybrid so the first generation of this plant will become an hybrid right this plant will be more prolific disease resistant resistant to salt and drought condition and won't get to the big size or the whole size maple tree that we normally have that would make it very easier for us to harvest the nuts from these and so forth so this is our dwarf tree right here so the advantage of this dwarf tree it is very short as you can see right here So what we do is we select we select the maple variety and breed with this short tree right here so we get an hybrid tree that is easier to harvest and has bigger nuts than the dwarf will normally have. Job well done. Right here easy as one two three four five steps how to germinate your coconuts it's your boy nick representing once more i say thank you for watching